Let's go groundhog hunting. We're back after the ever so elusive groundhog. <laughs> um, finally some absolutely beautiful weather. Truck thermostats is 18 degrees, clear skies and sunny. So. Got an hour or two this afternoon. Decided I'm just gonna go check a few farms. Just gonna roll by here real quick, make sure there's no livestock in the fields. And then we'll uh, set out on foot and see what we can discover. There'll be one or two out for sure. They won't be able to resist this weather. This is what uh, this is what groundhog hunting dreams are made of. Oh boy, we got one spotted. Well, we're gonna we're gonna park this old truck. We're gonna head up to that top of that hill and. Uh, I think we're going to stretch out the old 22250. See what we can do. That's good news. They are out and about. I knew they would be. Let's dive the old ram off the side of the road here. Certainly got this guy pegged. Let's spin you around. Seeing him. Oh, he's just down. Not bad. I believe he's right there. Yes, there he is. See if I can get a range on him. Nine to thirteen slide pods just so getting me out of the grass here. out. Let's 
certainly smoked him. You know, they dig themselves these perfect little graves. You just drop them down the hole and looked after. Let's go find another. Just got another one spotted. It's just, uh, it's down right now. It's right beside a fence post. So we might have to wait just a wee bit until we get enough to, enough to shoot at it. But yeah, I can just see his eye and his ear, but that may be all we need. So let's see if you guys can see it in the camera. Just to the left of that bottom of that post. Let's see if I can see him in the scope well enough to shoot. I'm just going to shoot them in the side of the face. I'm no uh, long distance shooter expert. By any means, just like any one of you, find what works and uh, stick with it. I am a fingertip shooter, just in that straight on the tip. I seem to that seemed to work pretty good, and also practice. One of the main reasons I'm out here something long enough you just get pretty decent at it. Check that out. We zinged them. Pick them up here. Like I said all we had to shoot at was the side of his head. That's that's all we needed. I aimed, aimed right here. He would have been in his, in his hole just peeking like this. We got that looked after, so. Like I said before, they make themselves these sweet little holes. See ya. Two down. It's only beginning. Beautiful afternoon. Let's go find another. Okay, I have just confirmed it certainly is a groundhog. All right, arrange it real quick. Yeah, you see him too. He's right there, center of screen, just peeking out of those logs. So the range is 253. Um, breeze is a little bit to the right, but mostly protected by the bush. So I'm gonna hold on his right cheek. Let's see.
got whack. <laughs> I think that told us all we need to know. Well, we've made the trek. Tensions are at an all-time high. That doesn't look like that ended well, does it? See if we're three for three. Oh yeah. Oh yes. The old Thompson Center icon, Precision Hunter. And let me down. Oh, that's a nice. This is this is harder than you'd think. I'll have you know. Well, success, success. Three for three, just like the Florida Panthers. Go Leafs, <laughs> please pull it together. All right, that was sick. Worked well, 253 yards. Last one I shot, it ended up ranging, and that was 189, so feel good about that. We'll just keep roaming the hills, see what we see. Farm buildings behind, that's a no-go. But my plan is to uh, head over, get up on those hills over here, and then I can shoot, shoot this direction, this big hill, and a bunch of holes in the side, so. If he's, uh, if he's still up. Oh, that was a bit violent, wasn't it? I was just heading up to this high ground I had mentioned, and uh, this one stood up just ahead of me, so I wasn't going to nod, so. This one doesn't need much confirmation. That was a good clean hit. Just a... Uh, just like you like them. No questions. No questions. Little tough to end the hunt with two misses, but that's reality. Um, see, I dressed up a little bit to say goodbye. Thanks for watching. Um, I'm off to go grab some wings with uh, with a buddy. Haven't seen him in a while. Just uh, go catch up with him. I encourage you to do the same. Reach out to a friend you ain't seen in a while. Go grab some wings. Anyway, thanks for now. Later. <laughs>